Hi guys, I've just been up in the loft, which is always a bad thing because I keep finding my old projects that I've stored up there. This is a propeller driven rubber band powered car made from coffee stirrers. Uh, that's foam discs for wheels. Bent paper clip for the shaft, a bit of uh, clear plastic for the propeller, which doesn't look like a very efficient propeller. Plastic drinking straws for the axle tubes, and that looks like uh, barbecue skewers, bamboo canes for the axles. They're not particularly free running for my. Uh, my more modern standards. Yeah, they rub a little bit, but we'll give it a go and I'll have a dig through my archives and see if I can find the original video. I'll either put the original video up in the top of the screen or, well, I'll put a link to it anyway. I think this was a part of a project where I had to make various different vehicles that were within a certain dimension, which is why it's sort of short and square shaped. I think it was something like 60 by 60. 60 by 60 by 60 millimetres. That looks about right. Anyway. I've put a fresh rubber band on it because the original one had gone hard and fell apart. A um, bit of plastic tubing there, plastic bead for a bearing surface. Everything hot glued together because I used to hot glue everything. That propeller looks awful, doesn't it? Oh, there's a bit of a breeze coming out now. We'll put it on the floor and see if we can annoy Nanny because she's cleaning the kitchen. Oh, <laughs> didn't aim that very well, did I? I'll try again. Well, not bad. We're not going to do the full length of the kitchen, I don't think. But I can wind it a bit further. Ah, going left every time now. Thank you. 
Oh uh, yeah, we've got a definite left turn on it. Oh, I think that'll do. I don't think I'm going to fix that today. We'll dig out the original video and see whether that went straight. Just one more go. A bit further. <laughs> Yeah, I know I said I wasn't going to try any more, and that was going to be enough for the day. But I'm going to have another go. Just see if we can get anywhere near the camera. I'll probably have to point it to the right so it curves to the left. did it we could probably have gone a little bit further but that's good enough for me we hit the camera <laughs>